Hello Saga Sol here and welcome back to Paleo Pines. Triassia Picnic has come around the corner once again. And I have lots of fragrant foods with me. But before we put all the food in the pile, let's talk to people. Mary. I think sharing festival days with everyone might be my favorite, you know. Dinosaurs have their herd and we have ours. We can all pig out together. Haha. <laughs> Hey, you need many more festival tickets? I found one in an old drawer at home. She gave us a festival ticket. Cool. Yep. And Owen? Yeah, we really wouldn't. Oh. The dinosaurs seem quite pleased at the offering this year. When they're pleased, I'm pleased. I think I've really gotten better at relaxing. Though it helps that Bongo is behaving himself. Yeah, I can imagine. And uh, Pippin? I think? So many flavors, so many customers. All thanks to you. Here, take these. I mean it. They gave us some more tickets. Marlo! been getting some solid compliments about my sculpture. At least I think the compliments. <laughs> but that's for another day. I worked hard enough. Today's a break. Here, you want a few of these? Can't thank you enough for your support and advice this year. Go on, take them. I got everything I need. Aw, that's nice. And... Granny. You know, this party used to be a 100% granny run. But this year I let Owen and Corlin do most of the heavy, heavy lifting. If I've learned one thing these past few years, an old girl like me needs her beauty sleep. <laughs> I got a, I got a few of these to spare. Go on, you have earned it. Aww. And without even putting a single piece of food in the pile, we already have nine tickets. Lovely. Right, let's put this all in. We got dandelions, we got tamabloom, we got saffron, we got a couple of spice root, we got cranberries, we got blueberries. We got blueberries, we got ginger. Ginger? Ginger. We got pears, we got peaches, we got truffles. I think we're good. I think. That's pretty much all I had. <laughs> Some advice be careful from wild friends. Take these, yeah. Five. Ten. Anything else? Nope. Now we have 39. And I know that we have more tickets in storage. I always forget to bring them. Anyway. I know that there is an achievement to have a full set of uh, Viridian Triassia picnic items. So I'm gonna I'm gonna get some stuff. All right, we need 20 per. Ah, get that. Apologies if you hear anything in the background, people are being noisy. Before we go and check on the uh, picnic, it appears that Avery has a quest or something to say at least. Remember those hubs I made you and your wee ones? They're working, yes? Mm-hmm. I'm thrilled to hear it. I declare the trials complete. I think it's about time I gave them to the person they were intended for. Would you be able to deliver these to Granny? I know Granny's not one for asking for assistance and will not school and are rather feisty. But maybe these will put that feistiness to fast fasted that word fastidiousness and take a few items of Granny's busy plate. 
Sure. Thanks, Olga. Let me know what she thinks. Yeah. A granny could use some help, I think. And while we are here, let's go check on Freya if she has anything. Any quest from Freya? Nope. Okay, let's go check on the picnic. And there we have a rather flame looking Rex. Flame is one of the new color schemes that were added in the color update. Um, if, if you two could move to the side a little bit. Hello. Oh, oh, oh dear. The Zillow Faces is running wild. Anyway, hello. Hey, you are gorgeous. You are actually so pretty. Uh, and you refuse to um, listen to me. No, that is the wrong dino. Hey, you are <laughs> the wrong dino. Rex. Please. Here we go. Hello. Oh, look at that. <laughs> How nice of the pink and purple want to join me for this. <laughs> That's actually really cute. Oh, oh, oh. Whoa. I'm... I don't really want a third Rex, but this one is so pretty. And Dino Storage is a thing. So... Oh, it's so pretty. Oh, come on. Okay, let's, let's give you a Tama Bloom then. Not really. <laughs> and this other Rex is just hugging me. <laughs> oh, I'm actually gonna take a screenshot of this. It's it's, <laughs> it's too cute not to. There we go. And fragrant poppin. Yes. I was getting hugged by this other Rex. <laughs> I am going to call you. Ember. I'm sorry. <laughs> I can't get all of you. Or I technically I could. But you know. It is a rare coloration. And it's so pretty. I'm gonna have you follow me around for the day. You gorgeous thing. We have these items that Avery gave us, and seeing as it is Saturday, Granny will be at home in Dapplewood, so that's pretty perfect to go and deliver these things. So let's go do just that. Oh, Granny! Where are you at? There you are. Granny, I have some I have some things. This weather been bungling with my seat again, struggling to get them to sprout. Makes you wish you had two pair of hands, eh? Avery sent these. These 
They really used to tinker with something that looked a bit like this. He made them for, uh, for, for you. You don't say. That's real good of him. Not sure I can train dinos the way he does, mind. But I'll give it a good go. If nothing else, it'll keep with him as with him out of mischief. Tell him my set thanks. Ah, wholesome. Wholesome, wholesome. I will. I will, Granny. Hey, Avery. Granny wanted to say thanks. Uh -huh. Did you deliver the hubs to Granny? <laughs> and what did she say? Was she appreciative? Was she surprised? Skeptical? Then what? On the second part, don't tell me. I'll just visit her myself. I can't thank you enough for your time, effort and generosity. I can't believe I never had the guts to go back to visit. I'm going to make a point of it whenever, whenever I'm in town. Here's a gift for you, Saga. It's small, but a big thing will come out of it. A lemon sprout. By the way, if you ever need more hubs yourself, Marlo's got the blueprints. Have you seen my Rex? Oh. Uh -huh. Knowing you as well as I do- Why am I so tall? <laughs> Knowing you as well as I do, Saga, I am certain of one thing. Wherever the wind takes us, we shall always be friends. I'm delighted to see you settled with so many wondrous companions. I hope this makes one of them feel at home. Dreamstone? Dreamstone! Ah, it makes sense that he would give you a small one. Uh -huh. That... How many Dreamstones are left? Uh, let's see... That's insane, by the way. <laughs> 440! <laughs> Absolutely insane. Right, right, right. I uh, think it says somewhere in here. Plant stats, NPC and other stats. Uh, no? Really? Hey, we, we reached the BFF with Avery. Now we just got a dose of for Freya, Orani, and Sara. Oh, here we go. That's. There's one dreamstone left. One dreamstone left. Wow, that's. Wow. I wonder who's going to give us the last one. Incredible. There is a dot above the rock out in the water. I don't think I've ever seen that before. Oh, oh, there's something written here. It says for Liam. We miss you. Liam must have been important somehow. Aww, who's Liam? Well, isn't this nice? Lovely, actually. Susie sitting over there. Watching. Probably wondering how the heck I got to, to this rock. That's nice. And the second day of the picnic. That right there looks like a flame Kentrosaurus. Hello. I don't really need a Kentro. Aww. So I am going to leave you be. But you are all very cute. <laughs> Absolutely adorable. 
We're going full on purple today. I purple this one to Sukus, purple Velociraptor, and purple Triceratops. That's how we're gonna roll today. I don't recognize that Stegosaurus. Could that be the new Atlas coloration, perhaps? Let's have a look. You're very pretty. So, what are you? You, my friend, are a rare Atlas. Yeah. Oh, it's cute. I say that about everything, but look at it. What a sweet, of, what a sweet little thing. And there we have another flame Kentrosaurus. Funny that we get two of them in the same day. Sweet. And the third day of the picnic gives us more Rexes. They're lovely, don't get me wrong, but it's not really what I hoped for. Happy budding day, Owen. Welcome to my budding day. Been hoping to see you. Baron's been by, so has Mallory and Mar Marlo. But I want to thank you especially for being such a good friend these past few years. I've been through some tricky times, but you always seem to be right around the corner with the right answer. Can't wait to see what the future brings. Yeah, I got you carrot cake. Delightful. This is really stupendous. Can't wait to stay taste it. But in days are a treat in themselves. What's your favorite way to spend a day like today? <laughs> Searching for new diners, cooking trees for friends. I like that answer. That sounds merry indeed. I've been known to dabble in the kitchen from time to time. If you take dabble to mean make the same dinner every night of your life, but still read off the recipe. Tell me, have you tried cooking with these? May they add some zest to your recipes. Lemon. He gave me some lemon. How oh, nice. Lemon, lemon, lemon. Tickles. Tickles, you're in the way. Tickles, please. Speaking of cooking, that is something that I have severely neglected, actually. So I think we are gonna do some cooking to end the episode. Just gonna grab some ingredients. And uh, I know tomato soup is one thing I need to get the mastery of. There we go, tomato soup. Yeah, so we'll take a few tomatoes. About ten. And we'll... Yeah, we'll do that. And we'll wait. There we go. And I need to do it... How many more? Oh, I need to do it three more times. <laughs> yeah! There we go. And then... Let's see, what else do we have? Um... There's a couple more soup recipes to discover. Let's see. What will they be? Hmm. Might have to try some of that out. Right. Uh, I might have to look up some of uh, some others. 
There's 14 recipes for jam. Eesh. That's... That's a lot. Okay. Uh... We'll... Look at that another time, I think. It's not the most interesting thing to watch. So we're gonna skip over to the next day. And um, actually, I'm gonna end it there. So um, yeah, I hope you enjoyed this little video. Thank you for watching and I shall see you next time. Pearl, please. I shall see you next time. Bye bye!